we're starting this video out with, uh, we're going to go to the grocery store. We did just go and get quite a bit of groceries, but there's just a few things on the list. I'm going to write them down and we're going to run down and get that. But before we go forward, I just need to say thank you so much for the prayers. I have this thing that um, I can tell when somebody is praying for me and you are praying for me. And God is renewing my strength. And I definitely appreciate that. It's crazy how you can go from, I'm not okay, I'm not going to make it. It's impossible to, you know, God just renewing your strength saying, okay, all right, God's going to give me the strength to dig in a little bit deeper, to have a little bit more faith, to become more like his son, Jesus, and to lean on his promises. And uh, he does that. He renews our strength and he encourages us and helps us to keep going. And one of the ways that he does that is through prayer. When we're just vulnerable and we're real and we share what's going on in our lives. God wants us to be us. Not to be a carbon copy, to be like somebody else. But he wants us to be us. And uh, I do share a lot with you guys. I overshare most of the time. And I know that can make some people uncomfortable. But, you know, for me, I'm an open book. I, I feel like I have nothing to hide and uh, I'm comfortable with who I am, where I live, you know, the things that God's blessed me with. And I'm totally cool with sharing, you know, the good times and the bad times. And because I'm confident in who God is, not because of me, but I know that um, he will lead me, you know, just like on the YouTube videos. Most of the time, I have no clue what I'm doing. All I know is that right now, I just want to be more real. And tell you the truth about things but um if you're just passing through hello hi my name's ashley <laughs> wow that was an entrance um so okay so we're at the store i've got my list it's diced tomatoes butter miracle whip waters um some kind of ground turkey meat um oats walnuts and raisins i'm getting that for a recipe uh the dollar general is right here so i'm thinking i need to go in there for the miracle whip because i'm pretty sure save a lot doesn't sell miracle whip i'm gonna look at the valentine's day stuff i don't decorate for valentine's day um and i don't know if there's something that i can't live without i might get it but probably not let's see I'm going to wait on the Miracle Whip because they have it for $1.25 or the Dollar Tree, a smaller one, and that's really all I need, so I'm going to wait on it. They don't have any Sprite Zero, or I would pick some of those up. And this looks good. I'm going to have to try that sometime. That is really expensive for this little bag of walnuts. I'm going to look at Save a Lot and see what they have. This is all of the diced tomatoes that they have, so I'm going to wait and look at Save a Lot as well. So we're back home. I got everything laid out. I'm going to show you what I got. I seen a lady do a grocery haul the other day and she had her receipt and she actually showed you the item and how much it cost. So I think that's what I'm going to go with because I really enjoyed that. Here's our list. I got some things not on the list and then I didn't get some of the things on the list. So we'll start right here with the Tide. Um, so the original price was $9.90. Uh, I'm sorry, $10.50 and I got it for $9.95. They were having a little bit of sale. I did get two packs of Laffy Taffy. Um, me and my husband both are a sucker for some Laffy Taffy. Uh, Lance Toasty Crackers. That's these crackers right here. I uh, like to have those occasionally. So then I got this $20 count uh, Ziploc freeze bags and quart size. I needed some more of those. This was $2.65. And then the Honey Made Graham Crackers, $4.95. I actually didn't know that. I thought they were $4. But we got the off-brand uh, from Walmart, and my husband didn't love them as much. So I'm hoping um, I got the right ones. These are made with real honey. He likes cinnamon. Did I get the wrong kind? I might have got just whole grain. Oops. Okay. Well, I might have got the wrong ones and I might have to take that and trade it, but that's okay. You can do that. That's why you keep your receipt. All right. So then from Save a Lot, 
I got, okay, so this is $11.98. That's these two guys. Look at this. This is a current video from Save a Lot. So these are $5.99 each. This is turkey breast, brown and oil, and uh, brown sugar ham. Both of these are fully cooked. That is three pounds each. That is great. Um, I would like to get another one of these turkeys and freeze it because I crave turkey meat. And so that's great. All right, so carrot slices. I got one can of that for $0.89. Cents and then I got uh, walnuts yeah three dollars and 89 cents for this bag it's funny because it was 10 cents cheaper at Dollar General but um, whatever I needed them because we're going to be doing some recipes uh, cucumbers that was 88 cents it's a zucchini I got one of those I got some mushrooms, a can of mushrooms right here. It's cheaper if you can buy the can of mushrooms than to buy fresh, but it is $1.29 for that can. And then some butter. Where's the butter? Right here, $4.49. Real butter. It's expensive, but, you know, you got to have butter. Butter makes everything good. Uh, then we've got some tomatoes, two cans of those, diced tomatoes. I never tried this brand. I'm sure they're going to be just fine, though. Um, uh, I got those for uh, 89 cents each. And then two 24 packs of water. I did get two waters right over here. If it'll focus, spring waters. And those were $3.99 each. And then I got a three pack of yeast for $1.49. And that's also going to be for a homemade bread recipe that we're going to try. But let me go ahead and get all of this put up. So the way that we do our grocery list is I have a board right here in the kitchen. And every time you notice that we're out of something, then you just write it on here. So right now I've got Miracle Whip, ground turkey, and raisins. I didn't get those things today. I don't have to be in a hurry to get them. I'll get them later. But um, yeah, what I'll do is I'll either write these things down on a sticky note or just take a picture of the board and take it with me. And that's how we keep up with our groceries. And it seems to work pretty well for us. All those years ago that never fade away And I remember your face When you hit the ground I can recall the time and place On the midnight walk Through the old streets Trying to turn back the clock not for dinner i did decide we're gonna go ahead and eat some of this turkey and then i've got some green beans from our garden we do have potatoes left from our garden it's just on our property and i haven't went and got any yet so if i don't go get some then we'll just have these but if not then we'll eat potatoes from our garden and then i have this packet of turkey so it's a super easy meal to put together semi-healthy and affordable so i'm looking forward to tonight's dinner you have a save a lot near you go get you some of this turkey and some of the ham all of the turkey that i got out it was only like one third of how much meat is actually there for the price you can have this for sandwiches you could put it in omelets whatever i mean this is a great deal but thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one